Imagine a world without apples or almonds, cherries or clover. Imagine a world for that matter where 70% of all our crops simply disappeared. That's where we'd be without bees to pollinate our crops. But bees are in trouble. About a third of bee colonies collapse every year. We need to turn this around and fast. Here are three things we can all do to help. First, plant more blooming trees and flowers in our gardens, yards, and public spaces like parks and roadsides. That can help counter the loss of natural habitat through development. Next, we need the Environmental Protection Agency and the U.S. Department of Agriculture to cancel the use of a class of pesticides that are contributing to the deaths of bees. These pesticides, called neonics, were introduced about 20 years ago. Now, they're the fastest growing and most widely used insecticides in the United States. They've got to go, and the sooner the better. Finally, we need to tell the big chemical companies to stop making neonics pesticides. Bayer Chemical is the world's largest manufacturer of these insecticides. I hope you'll join NRDC in asking Bayer to stop selling Neonix pesticides in the United States and start saving our bees and our crops.